A haunting look at the last photos of extinct animals. How about if I told you that you could travel back in time and see the dying moments of some of the world's most magnificent creatures? Prepare for an emotional roller coaster that will leave you with a deeper awareness of our planet's fragile environment. You won't want to miss this video. Pictures and tales cannot bring the dead back to life, but we hope that this video can serve as a resource for communal grief, a way to visualize the magnitude of the loss, and possibly a prod to action. Extinction is a sad but unavoidable component of the natural world's cycle of existence. Over millions of years, many species have vanished from the face of the Earth. As human activities and climate change have increased, the rate of extinction has escalated at an alarming rate. In this video, we take a look at the final shots of extinct creatures, a collection of images that serve as a heartbreaking reminder of the fragility of life and the destructive consequences of our actions. Number 10. Pinta Island Tortoise The Pinta Island Tortoise, a subspecies of the Galapagos tortoise, may be the most recently proclaimed extinct big mammal. The final member of the family, a male named Lonesome George, who was more than 100 years old, died of heart failure on June 24, 2012. The species was thought to be extinct by the middle of the 20th century, with the vast bulk of them murdered by the end of the 19th. But George was discovered in 1971. Aside from human annihilation, the introduction of non-native animals such as goats resulted in habitat degradation, which ultimately contributed to the tortoise's extinction. Number 9. Aurochs These enormous herbivores were once a sight to behold, standing six feet tall and weighing more than 3,000 pounds, with horns measuring more than four and a half feet from tip to tip. Paleolithic humans drew them on cave walls around the region. In 1655, Swedish troops invaded Poland and pillaged whatever they could find. Jack Tarub was captured with one of King Sigismund III's most valued possessions a beautiful drinking horn the length of a grown man's arm and as thick as an elephant tusk. Regardless of the craftsmanship, the horn's basic worth has nothing to do with the metal wrapped around its circle. The horn came from the last aurochs bull, which died in 1621. The horn, which is currently on display in Stockholm's Royal Armory, is one of the last surviving remnants of the wild cow, which roamed Eurasia and North Africa for about 250,000 years. Humans killed off the aurochs, as they did so many other European megafauna. Their horns were such sought-after hunting trophies that by the medieval ages, their numbers had already decreased. The species was officially declared extinct when the last cow died in Poland in 1627. Number 8. Alca impenis The Alca impenis, or big auk, was a magnificent bird that previously inhabited wide areas of the North Atlantic. Unfortunately, in 1844, the last remaining great auk was hunted and killed, resulting in the extinction of the whole species. We can't help but feel a sense of loss and grief when we view a video of their native environment and learn about their behavior, knowing that we will never have the opportunity to experience their magnificence in person. This is a stunning reminder of the fragility of our planet's ecosystems and the devastation that people may inflict on the natural world. Number 7. The Northern White Rhinoceros The only two live northern white rhinos are both female after the final male died in March of 2018. Sudan, a 45-year-old man, died of old age and infection while under armed watch at Kenya's Ol Paheta Conservancy. The two females are likewise unable to bear children, making the introduction of a new generation of the species exceedingly unlikely. Scientists are attempting to build a lab-created northern white rhino using extracted sperm cells and in vitro fertilization. Poaching has destroyed this species, and habitat degradation has also contributed to the rhino's demise. Number 6. Thylacine The thylacine was the only contemporary member of the Thylacinidae family, which includes multiple extinct species. The thylacine was a slender, fox-faced mammal that hunted wallabies and birds at night. It was 100 to 130 centimeters, 39 to 51 inches long, including its tail, which was 50 to 65 centimeters, 20 to 26 inches. Its weight ranged from 15 to 30 kilograms, 33 to 66 pounds, with an average of 25 kilograms, 55 pounds. The hair on the back and rump was yellowish-brown with 13 to 19 black bands. 
The marsupial wolf, Tasmanian tiger, and Tasmanian wolf were assumed to be extinct soon after the last captive specimen died in 1936. Thylacine has been discovered on the Australian continent and in New Guinea, and it had only been restricted to Tasmania historically. Competition with the dingo most likely resulted in its extinction on the continent. It was regularly hunted by European settlers in Tasmania because it was seen to pose a menace to the domestic sheep imported to the island. By 1914, it was scarce, and the last known surviving example died in a private zoo in Hobart in 1936. It vanished from the wild two years later. Number 5. Beiji River Dolphin also known as the Chinese River Dolphin, this freshwater species was native to the Yangtze River but was declared functionally extinct in 2006 due to human activity. The Baiji had a bulky build and large rounded flippers. The head was small with a prominent melon, a long narrow beak with an upturned tip, and a long mouth line. The Baiji is the sole member of the Lipotidae mammal family. This is due to the Baiji's distinct characteristics which are not shared by any other whale or dolphin species. The Baiji's bones and stomach structure are distinct. The stomach is divided into three compartments. The extinction of the Baiji also means the end of the ancient Lepotidae family, which the Baiji represented. The Lepotidae diverged from the other river dolphin families around 20 million years ago during the evolutionary process. Number 4. Pyrenean Ibex the Pyrenean ibex is a subspecies of the Spanish ibex and one of the species' two extinct subspecies. They resided in Spain's Cantabrian Mountains and southern France's Pyrenees Mountains. Experts are unsure why the Pyrenean ibex became extinct, but they believe it was due to poaching, sickness, and a lack of food and habitat due to other herbivorous ungulates in the region. As a result of these factors, the subspecies population declined from 50,000 to less than 100 during the 20th century. The last known Pyrenean ibex, a female called Cecilia, died in the year 2000 from wounds caused by a tree falling on it. Nonetheless, just before she died, doctors extracted cells from her ear in the hopes of cloning her and stored them in liquid nitrogen. They succeeded in cloning Cecilia nine years later. The clone, however, only lived for seven minutes after birth due to lung abnormalities and perished. Scientists are still working on cloning the Pyrenean ibex in order to repopulate the earth. Number 3. Woolly Mammoth Woolly mammoths roamed the world for millions of years before becoming extinct approximately 4,000 years ago. Humans, who would kill the creatures for sustenance and use the mammoth's corpses to build shelters, have been widely blamed for their inexplicable disappearance. While the six-ton, nine-foot-tall animals were a favorite human catch, a new study reveals that they were not the cause of mammoth's extinction, but rather climate change, which continues to imperil wildlife today. Number 2. Saber-toothed Tiger The name saber-toothed tiger comes from the large canine teeth in their upper jaw. These massive teeth might grow to be seven inches long. A saber-toothed tiger's mouth was large enough to accommodate them. The saber-toothed tiger became extinct between 10,000 and 12,000 years ago. They became extinct at the end of the late Pleistocene epoch, when the last ice age ended, during the Quaternary Extinction. Saber-toothed tigers became extinct as a result of human overhunting during a period of climatic change. Around the same time, the saber-toothed tiger and other megafauna became extinct. Number 1. Moa The moa provided an accessible source of food for the new immigrants when humans first arrived in New Zealand between 121500. Evidence of moa eating has been discovered at archaeological sites around New Zealand, where enormous bones have been uncovered as abandoned remnants on ancient garbage heaps known as middens, or as worked pieces in the shape of fish hooks. According to research, the moa died out in around 100 years, and they were assumed to be extinct by the time European immigrants arrived in New Zealand in the 18th century. Seeing the final photographs of extinct creatures is a stunning and emotional experience that shows humanity's catastrophic influence on the natural world. By concentrating on these photos and the stories they represent, we may comprehend the importance of conservation efforts and take action to protect our planet's biodiversity. If you want to understand more, watch our YouTube video and give your opinions in the comments section below.
Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more up-to-date information. Let us work together to ensure that future generations will be able to experience the beauty and wonder of the world's animals. Thanks for watching.